Hello, great to have you with us. And this is the scene here at the Lusale Stadium, just to the north of Doha. I'm Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board alongside me is Stuart Robson, my commentary partner. And both teams looking to get off to a flying start here on match day one for them at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's Argentina, and they take on Saudi Arabia. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. The Argentina first team. Lionel Messi starts with Angel Di Maria on the flanks and leading the line, Lautaro Martinez. And a look at the starting lineup for Saudi Arabia. Well, although we have it down as a 4 5 1, it's actually more likely to be a 4 2 3 1. They play with two holding midfield players, a number 10, and two wingers. The system has a nice balance to it. Rodrigo de Paul. Plenty of options. Could be flinging himself at it, the keeper. Let's see about the delivery. And the problem not completely solved. And a super header. It looked as though it might be going in. A corner will ensue. Lionel Messi. And played in. And a goal! to open the scoring a very bright start to this one well here it is again Messi's cross really invites somebody to go and attack it and it's a comfortable finish in the end which is made to look so easy it's a lovely goal Paredes, Gomez, and it goes! Two goals in rapid-fire fashion, and looking very comfortable here. Well, let's take another look, and it's a very good goal, and they deserve it, you have to say. They've been excellent. Gomez, oh big chance, and tremendous goalkeeping. Well he just made it so difficult for the striker, his presence alone just caused him a problem. Fired over by Messi, wonderful header, excellent goalkeeping. Well, another corner, hot on the heels of the last one. Di Maria, now Messi, real chance, and it goes, well it's one goal after another, a highly impressive performance. Well I have to say, this is a really good goal, just watch his technique here, he just hits through the back of the ball with such power, there's no stopping that. Now well, Molina. Martinez, can he put it away? Well, the keeper had to concentrate. Well, 
well, Argentina are enjoying most of the possession. Yes, they've played well when going forward. In it goes! He's made it a brace for himself. No stopping him, apparently. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. Martinez. Oh, there it is! It's one goal after another, and it speaks to the quality of that performance. Well, let's take another look, and it doesn't come much closer than this, does it? He just squeezed it in off that post. Very good finish. Now well, Molina. Good ball to switch the play. In there by Di Maria. Well, choosing to chip, and it wasn't so very far away. Well, it was good vision, excellent technique, but not quite the end result it deserved. Well, nicely cut out. Now what can they do with the ball? In with a chance! And there is the goal! to make it a hat-trick excellence in finishing there for all to see well let's see this again what a pass this is from Messi and what a clinical finish this is from Lataro. he hits it with such power that's a good goal Di Maria Real chance. A goal! We're really being spoiled. This is attacking football at its finest. Well, as you can see, he beats the defenders so easily with a change of pace, and then it's a decent finish. That's a very good goal, you have to say. The final whistle, a victory for Argentina, precisely what their fans were hoping for, Stuart. Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest.